So for this tutorial, you're going to need your fabric. So you can either use organza fabric or two nets. You're going to need your crinoline, you're going to need hemi tape, and you're going to need your fabric piece that you're going to use for the fabric edging. Now you need to make sure that your two net or your um, organza fabric it has like a straight cut. Okay, my last tutorial showed us how to add crinoline to a rounded fabric. I'm showing us how to add crinoline to a straight cut fabric with fabric um, edging. So I'm going to show you the detailed process on how to do this. Okay? So one important thing to take note of is your fabric for the fabric edging and your crinoline. Now, what you need to do is to make sure that the fabric that you're going to use is going to be able to cover your crinoline on both ends so did you see what i did here so it is covering my crinoline on both ends by about a half an inch okay so that is very very important my crinoline width is 1.25 inches so the fabric length that i have here is um, or fabric width that i have here is 2.25 inches so it's going to cover one side by half an inch it's going to cover one side by half an inch the bigger the size of your crinoline the bigger you know the width of your fabric okay so this is what i'm going to do now i've placed the fabric piece okay that's what we're going to use for the fabric edging with the right side touching the wrong side of the organza fabric. Now, how do I know this is the wrong side? This is because I joined the pieces together and I have a seam. Okay, so where the seam allowance is showing is the wrong side of my fabric. Now, what I'm going to do at this point is to place hemming tape while I sew. This part is very, very important in order for the edge of your fabric, you know, to come out looking neat when you are done sewing. So I'm going to place hemi tape right here while I sew this and I'll be sewing this fabric to the organza fabric with a half an inch seam allowance, okay? This is a straight edge fabric, so it's pretty easy for us to do this. I'm just going to sew this by a half an inch from beginning to the end of the fabric. Sewing, this is what we have and what we want to do next is to go on to turn it like this okay that is what i'm going to do and we're going to be inserting our crinoline into this space so i'm just going to insert my crinoline right here okay insert it right here and what i'm going to do is to fold this part in and we're going to be sewing on the crinoline what i would advise you to do is to not stretch your crinoline while sewing please don't don't do that at all and you need to make sure that your crinoline is where the seam is okay you need to make sure very very important you need to make sure that your crinoline is where the hemming tape is okay so that by the time you press that area down it is going to glue your crinoline down to the fabric all right, so just make sure it is right there and then you can go on to begin sewing. Like I said, it is very, very important that you do not stretch your crinoline while sewing, okay? So just go on to sew your crinoline on the top, just like this. this is what i have and what i'm going to do right now is to press this part down in order for us to activate the glue in the hemming gum so that this place can lay really nice and flat okay so that is what i'm going to do for this part so after pressing this this is how flat this part looks so can you see how neat and flat it is so that is the essence of putting the hemming gum right at the bottom as you saw in the video so i hope you enjoyed this tutorial if you did kindly give us a thumbs up subscribe to my channel turn on the bell so you get updates when i post new videos and i'm going to be seeing you guys in my next tutorial bye